We're back and we're mad. No, we're happy. We're happy. <laughs> this is what a microphone is. I feel like a singer. Have Give us a song. And I Second lesson of YouTube, copyright. You can't do anything. Oh. Dummy. <laughs> mm. It is with the utmost pleasure that I introduce today's sponsor, Holes Kern. Isn't that right, Mr. Biggles? <laughs> Everybody knows that I'm quite delighted by watches and fine jewels and precious little kitties. Which is why I've partnered up with Holzkern. Holzkern are world leaders in watches, jewellery and accessories made from fine natural stone and wood materials. And they've sent me this box. Have a look at this little box here. Nice, solid. Pull that out. Naturally unique. Their range of exquisite pieces are some of the most beautiful pieces I've ever seen. I've got quite the collection of watches, but this one from Holzkern is probably one of my favourites, actually. Let's take a look. That is cool. Look how beautiful this watch is. I picked this one from the site. This is probably my favorite looking one. It's got real wood grain right there. It shimmers in the light. You notice the shimmer there. The shimmer is very important to attract the babes. The good thing with these watches as well is being pretty unique looking actually. They're all very affordable. Have a look at that. It's all real wood grain. You can see the quality there. It's a very cool watch. This one actually charges just by wearing it on your wrist. It actually looks pretty good. But don't fear, my lady friends. Holzkern caters to all. They have thousands of different products for men and women, especially the most important women in the world are mums. I just earned 50 brownie points with my mum for that one line. If you want those extra brownie points this year, I've got a special discount code for you to spoil your mum's coming Mother's Day. So go ahead and use code DUBDADDY at the link in the description or scan my unique QR code here because every mum is one of a kind and so is every Holzkern piece. And also, if you order by May 7th, they will guarantee delivery by Mother's Day in the US. Thank you, Holzkern. Look at this thing we just found. It's the first thing we logged into on, on TikTok and uh, it's got like... Are you going to get copyrighted for It's got 500000 Thousand likes, yes. Look at this. The ghost was doing a stanky leg. <laughs> Wow. Best copyright claim ever. Wait, that just wait, made wait. the whole thing like seem like a lot of fun. Can I explain something to the viewers? Yes. Josh and Juicy came back after that video and I was in the hotel room and <laughs> Josh and Juicy come in at 6am and come up to me and was like, we summoned a ghost with the stanky leg. It's and true. It was the weirdest experience of my entire life being woken up to that, doing the stanky leg. We've been dating for me. over a year now <laughs> and that's the weirdest experience of your life? That is? It was at 6am. Are you and sure you that one is the one? And doing the stanky leg and like screaming. I don't think it happened like 50 other. people here and doing a real life Mario party was weirder. Mm. No, thank you, leg. Hiring a snake handler to throw it on Young Gravy, that wasn't the strangest thing. No, thank you, leg. Blowing up four microwaves and then you having to drive to the dump and explain you why you have four microwaves. No, five. It was five microwaves and they were like, why do you have five microwaves? And I was like, oh, I got a boyfriend. That, was, that wasn't <laughs> the weirdest thing? What about when I um, come home and I was like, Molly and Lana are in hospital because uh, Chad and Laser Beam almost killed them in the back of a moving van. That wasn't the weirdest thing? I still love the Thank you, leg. Uh, okay, fine. I put thank you. Thank you, leg, leg is the new king. I think I made narrator do the thank you, leg for me ten times that next. You day. did. You're a real thank you, leg it. connoisseur. He's so good. Okay, get over him. Don't he's you think? A, like he's, he's like. He is engaged. <laughs> Me when my job finally confronts me on my digital footprint. Oh, this is like when you get a job and they check your social medias and stuff. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's what it's like having a job. Shut, what the hell is that supposed to mean? <laughs> I have a job. I work hard. Do you want to go over what you just went? I ate a five thousand dollar piece of steak once for a day in the office, and it was hard. Three more wrestlers. Stanky leg. Stanky leg. Okay, here we go. When you told Drake to murder your vagina, I actually wasn't being insincere. I was like saying. Murder my vagina. Uh -huh. you, were, you were serious. I was serious, yeah. but I was also on drugs. When you tell a what? Drake. Oh, when you tell Drake to murder your vagina. I don't know why I said vagina so Australianly. Vagina. Uh, okay, let's continue. Want to cheat always a cheddar. This is exactly what happens when you piss me the fuck off. Oh my god. I'm done. I'm fucking done. Oh my god, what the hell? What is the story behind this? <laughs> Once a cheater, always a cheddar. Girl, you are going to jail. <laughs> Crying emoji. Proud of you for being the bigger person. Amen. But like, have you ever been cheated on and you're like, I'm going to slash our tires? I'm going to burn this mini to the ground. That's like the step above slashing tires, I think. Like, that's his iconic. Way. And I love to do iconic Yeah, this seems like shit. a person that's not stable. If I had a mini, I would not date this person. Do not oh, date this person. You went into their profile. This is how you get in rabbit holes. The rumors, the nastiness. The rumors, the nastiness. <laughs> this person is unstable. I've 
never even thought to go see what the kind of people yeah, posting this. You're on another level of TikTok. Yeah, I always have been. Grand. Eleven million is how we do it. All right, next one. We come to set you Shadisha, where we have car washes for life. Ad. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, it really is the official page of Central House Houston Nissen. Who's in charge of marketing? They deserve a raise. Too fucking true. Oh my god. I was wondering where this was going when I was seen all of that in my face. God, that transition was excellent. It was really good, hey. What cars got behind him? Really Nissen. Genius. Yeah. Alright, here we go. I need an espresso martini. Give me an espresso martini right now. I need it now. <laughs> That's me. What the hell? Don't be telling people what I'm really like off camera. What is it? Why is that like me? Because you like espresso martinis. Because I like espresso martinis. Okay. You okay? I have a stitch. You have a stitch. We're three videos in. Give me an espresso martini. All right, just so you know, if you haven't met Margot before, she does not keep her emotions in check very well. When she's happy, she's very happy. When she's sad, she's very sad. And that's one of my favorite things about her, actually. And my love of espresso martini. Yes, that was me when I wanted espresso martini. Give me an espresso martini now. Okay, I'm starting to feel like this is just your opportunity to bully me in front of a lot of people. <laughs> Give me espresso martini. <laughs> Wait, I hear, I hear something. Biggles? Oh, here he is. My baby. Say hi. So this is Mr. Beagles. He's our little boy. Baby. He's kind of chubby looking. He's not. He's a little chubby looking. He's just thick. His balls are going in 15 days, by the way, everyone. What do you think, Mr. Beagles? Are your balls going? Hi, Mr. Beagles. <laughs> That's uh, the official statement from Biggles. Okay, thank you very much for that uh, excellent TikTok, Margo. Just teasing me and making everyone look like I'm an alcoholic. Oh, yeah, I would like an espresso martini, please. Yes, please, Mr. Biggles, I want an espresso martini. It's triggered him. Yeah. He knows what you're like. Yeah. Oh, Allison, okay, uh, this I will explain first. What's the, what's the law? Okay, the law is Pretty Little Liars. Have you seen it? <laughs> yes, girl. I, I didn't think you had, so I okay. wanted you to understand how and wild this show is. Okay, you ready? <laughs> yeah. Allison, after meeting 100 people on the night she went missing. Spencer, after stealing all of her sister's boyfriends. If that is your sister, she is fucking your boyfriend. No, she's actually the most innocent out of all five of them. I believe that. And she's still fucking all of her sister's boyfriends. Yeah. Emily, after dating a girl that tried to drown her. Aria, after she married her teacher. I don't know if I want you watching the show anymore. Mona after hitting her best friend with a car. Hannah after got back to Caleb after he dated her best friend. Toby after he became a police officer in like five days. Caleb after leaving Hannah to go to Ravenswood. Ezra after dating minors. Emily after dating every lesbian bi girl in town. Jason after transforming into Jesus in the last season. Allison after meeting a hundred race the same thing. We're back. Okay. What do you think? Do you want to watch it? Um, I think I just did. <laughs> I know all the. Why would I watch it now? I know everything about the You're show. Sorry, so spoiler right. warning for the entire fucking show apparently. Oh, <laughs> well, thank you for that. That's okay. You are welcome. Okay, that was kind of cute, so I'll let it slide. Do you think Google is a male or a female? Definitely a female. Why do you say that? Because she won't let you finish a sentence before making a suggestion. <laughs> What do you think? <laughs> this is one of the things that I hope AI can replace one day. Oh my god. Luke the Duke 24. Killing it on the daily. Anyway, this is- Me and my wife I just have. do goofy and cringe shorts. All right, I gotta say, this is obviously satire and these people are hilarious. <laughs> and he's really got the like- He really does, but his shirt, how do you own that unironically? <laughs> how are you so good at that? Good. Should we recreate it? Yes. Babe. How do you know if Google's male or female? I don't know. I don't know. Because they never let you finish their sentences. Like and subscribe. <laughs> that was our first one. That was really good. I tried to high five you and you left me. Oh. <laughs> Next one. So a 20 year old can't have alcohol, but a five year old can pick their gender? I agree, but we should lower the drink age to five for real. Ben said that. I'm sorry for everyone who decided to click on this video. I know that you were suggested other videos at the time of clicking on this video, and I apologize for uh, the decision that you made. All right, we're going to the next one. What the fuck is he, he doing? He's dancing with a pony. <laughs> What 
the f- How do you like get someone to hold the camera to film this in the first place? I didn't even like. Is this just? I a, didn't even think about that. Is this a stranger that they're like? Hey, can you just hold this read for a the, second? Read the and then they're like, I found a tame deer in the forest today. Not a deer. First of all, second of all, six trees does not constitute a forest. I like this person, Jilly, who says, "Mentally, I am here." <laughs> Jilly, uh, it's not, it's not good. But he was a fairy, <laughs> okay, and he tamed a deer. It was in the forest. You don't understand. Have you ever felt like this though? Me? Yeah, yeah exactly like this. And until yeah. I've seen this, I uh, really had trouble putting into words how I felt at uh, my parents' funeral. <laughs> No, if I listen to music like this, that's how I'm feeling. A balding 40-year-old man dancing with a Shetland pony in a field. Yeah, me too. Hey! You little bastard. Oh, wow. He's a little piss pot. That was my $4,000 chair, you little asshole. Now it's only going to be sold for $3,000. Okay. Guys, I'm in the middle of the ocean, and I think there's a shark circling me right now. I'll give you $5 million for 25% equity in a crocodile. Okay, 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 okay. What the f*** does that mean? Shark Tank? Is that what it's... No, they can't. I think they call like business people like sharks, like that come out like salesmen. Like, isn't it like Shark Tank? Isn't that what the show's like? Wait, are you laughing and you're not even entirely sure you understand the punchline? No, I get it, kinda. It's like they call sharks like salesmen, like they're, they're sharks. Okay. Why is Walmart and Mr. Clean commenting on I don't on know it? what Mr. Clean is. It's a cleaning brand. Oh. Okay, this has got an interesting <laughs> start. Shout out to my grandma from Crack Groove. First frame is. Oh no. Nah, nah, nah. If I was dying and my grandkids did not dance to some kind of hit song in front of me while filming themselves and dancing, I would know that they don't love me. Yeah, they hate you. What it's like reading texts from that one friend who can't tape, type. What it's like reading texts from that one friend who can't type. We will have that. I think I might be that friend I sometimes. I am that friend. Oh. That's why I was doing it. Oh. The shape goes into a shape press that presses the shape into a pressed shape. This reminds me of that Rick and Scorty making a plumbus thing. Morty. Yeah, making a yeah. Ma yeah. The florbin goes into the florbalizer, and that's how we get all the phlegm juice. That always confused me. I always just thought I didn't understand what was going on, and people. You actually got brought into early psychosis because it was really stressful because I asked so many people. I didn't even, I even asked you. I was like, "But what is it? But what is a plumbus? A plumbus. A plumbus." Who speaks for the chickens, for the dogs, for the cats, for the cows? We milk and we milk and we milk and they say, ow! Mammals of the world, stop eating animals of the world! Hey guys, what is up? Today I am going to be eating an entire bucket of KFC chicken. <laughs> You love Trisha Paytas. Okay, Trisha, if you're watching this as well, get in contact. She looks like she's trying not to laugh here. She's on crack there. Oh. Yeah, she had a big crack phase in 2019. Nice, uh, someone to look up to, kids. Mm. Who speaks for the chickens, for the dogs, for the cats, for the cows? We milk and we milk and we milk and they say, ow! I gotta say, if anyone approached me, doing any of this shit, I would assume that they were going through their crack phase, yeah. yeah. Literally me. She's going through her crack phase, meow. What the fuck do you mean, literally me? Have you seen any of her things where she's like, the layer of the center of the earth? What's the thinnest layer of the earth called? The thinnest layer of the earth? Correct. Oh, thank you. I got a point. <laughs> Sorry. No, wait, what? You didn't answer. No, you were just clarifying the question. You, she, your answer to the question was a question? Can we just also say we don't actually need gravity? <laughs> Like, we actually don't need it. What do you mean that we don't need gravity? What if it was never invented? <laughs> it's because you have kind of a, sometimes a pretty funny explanation for things. Thank you. That's such a nice thing to say. I can't, I'm actively losing brain cells watching this shit, Margot. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know it's funny. Holy f At least I know I don't make the most brain dead content on the platform anymore. <laughs> thank you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and she really extends the last two letters of everything she says. Mm. Thank you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right, he's winding, winding up the punch. Oh! <laughs> Let's recreate this one. But without the punching bag. Damn. Wait, does it just play the whole <laughs> song? That was oh, pretty yeah? good. Yeah, that was good. Yeah! Do you know if the, in the full, we got one. In the full one video? Point, it's Margo. only because it involved women abuse. <laughs> Do you realize that? Papa. I do realize yeah. that. <laughs> You're the one that sent it to me. What do you mean? Like, how dare you be entertained by this? She didn't actually get abused. What? It was pre-abuse. Oh. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Cooking tips from an Iraq veteran. Okay, this should be uh, interesting and hopefully not give us PTSD. Frozen Uncrustable. And all you got is the Buck 110 handy. I'll show you a cool trick I learned in Iraq, in Fallujah. 
Where is Abdullah bin Al-Aswami? You answer me now, you swine. I like this. I like it. I'm about to nut. I'm gonna nut. Oh. This man's gonna get himself banned from every school and mosque. <laughs> Shit like this puts you on a list. <laughs> oh my god, what the f was that? <laughs> I am never letting this man around children or weapons or buck 110s or whatever he called that fucking pocket knife at the start. <laughs> You like it? I don't know what it was about, but it scared me. Coach replies to shut up. No can do, buckaroo. I don't shut up, I grow up. And when I look at you, I throw up. Mm -hmm. That's pretty good. <laughs> yeah. I don't shut up, I grow up. And when I look at you, I throw up. You said that so good, babe. Do it again. Shut up. How about no? No, you gotta wait. How about No! Okay. It's yelling. You'll regret this! You got really good angry face. That's it. I'm activating my Sigma mode. That sounds kind of gay for some reason. Bro, oh, let's get, get ready to feel the pain train. <laughs> Who does that? Like, what if your mom is like beating you in an argument? What are you going to go like, oh, get ready to feel the pain train. You've definitely done that to your mom. Yeah. Well, she moved a pencil on your desk. Looks like someone wants to get on my dark side. Those who do never go back. You see, I don't care about others' lives. They're all meaningless. Everything is meaningless. The tree, the sky, the ocean. We all die one day, so it doesn't really matter, does it? I might as well enjoy myself. How many would do I do? How would I do that, you may ask? People enjoy themselves by playing video games. Others might play a sport. I don't do any of those. Instead, I just enjoy seeing the looks on people's face when they suffer! <coughs> Why are you not an actor? I am acting right now. Oh, wow. I love it. I am better! All right, there you go. I don't know why you, the f you sent me that. That was a juicy meme. I really liked it. Oh, I liked it, but you've, that's attractive. Yeah. And your dog said he really, really didn't want to go to the dog park. Okay, you didn't read that. Read that again. Okay. When your son said he really, really didn't want to go to the dog park. Yeah, you said when your dog. Oh. <laughs> Seen all the dogs and I just thought dog. Okay, it's getting kind of weird. <laughs> it's not our dog, by the way. That's a little... <laughs> I don't know, it feels kind of weird. Isn't that like me when I see a dog, though? <laughs> I just look at it and scream, and then the I'm not about like, like the laying down and like I don't cuddle it, no, but like I will scream at it, cry, reach out to it, get this annoy the owner. Get this fucking kid a dog. Get him a giant beagle. Me? The beagle's bigger than him. What? Am I the kid? No. Oh f me. What is this? Oh, f Tonight for dinner is just something super, 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 super simple. Ganu cheese, um, with marinara sauce, I guess. Um, is she trying to say gnocchi? Kanuchi. Okay, let's continue. Mm, I actually love Kanuchi. This is rage bait. It's making me mad. Do you think? Yeah. But you do this. That's why I like it. Well, I love Cham Pagane. <laughs> mm -hmm. What oh, the f eyes. is her eye doing that for? The her like childlike but also dead stare in her eyes. Reminds me of this guy. Dinner! You know the rules. When this dude swallows, it looks really painful. Beef. What? That's my puree. Mad I hated everything like that. <laughs> Why is his mouth open? But his Why is he choking on his food? He's not chewing it long this enough. This is this is this is like a male mukbang. It has to be kind of oh, weird. Oh, that's you eating a glizzy. Don't fucking compare me to Bevo. They could be brother and sister right now. I think they're both weird. They're both eating on TikTok. She likes. I'm sure he likes Ganucci. Say migoring. Mingoring, Jay. Yeah, let's keep Just going. Just can't say migoring. No. Psych ward. O -O What's O O T D? Outfit of the day. Oh. OTD. Okay. <laughs> this is proving that pretty girls are psychos. <laughs> Have you been in a psych ward? Yeah. Yeah. I'm pretty, obviously. Exactly. The, <laughs> look, let me show you the scale. The hot crazy matrix. This is a universal matrix. <laughs> Where do I sit on the hot crazy scale? Danger zone. Redhead strippers, girls named Tiffany. Margot was very close. <laughs> Hairdressers, danger zone. I think you were over here and I've brought you down over you here. You have, you've really I've brought you down me. to the date zone. You have, you made me uglier. You're a nine and then <laughs> you're, you're a 10 when you like, you're confident and so never. feeling happy. Just you are. <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> when you're like in a really good mood and stuff, then, uh, you know. What's the craziest thing I've ever done to you? The craziest thing you've ever done. Oh, do you remember one time when you looked at me and you were like, which car's tires do you value the most? <laughs> because I want to know which one that I'm going for if you ever cheat on me. Do you remember that? 
I do. And you only slash three girlies. You only slash three. All right, let's go back to the TikToks. Okay. You're teaching too much impressionable kids about stuff. Your Honor, my client was simply standing on business. Your Honor, my client didn't know that was illegal. Your Honor, my client was rapping the lyrics as the artist intended. Your Honor, respectfully, you weren't f***ing there, okay? <laughs> Your Honor, my client was hitting them folks. Your Honor, my client did not do that shit. <laughs> Your Honor, my client's the powerhouse of the cell. Your Honor, my client would like to plead Gemini. Your Honor, my client was thinking of that one girl from 2019. Your Honor, my client was simply going goblin mode. Your Honor, my client's Mexican. He can say it. Your Honor, my client turned himself into a fucking pickle. Your Honor, my client thought the Xbox mic was muted. Your Honor, if drinking bath water is illegal, you can lock me up too. <laughs> Your Honor, my client would have gotten away with it too if it wasn't for these meddling kids. Your Honor, who am I? Oh, guilty, guilty, dumb fuck. <laughs> Your Honor, what does convicted mean? Your Honor, my client is the most innocent client. Your Honor, you're a great honor. You're the best honor. Some would say the most innocent. I walked in here, I said, wow, he looks innocent. Your Honor, that's cap. Your Honor, you're kind of being a D-bag right now. Uh, Your Honor, what the fuck? Your Honor, my client was hitting the doggy. <laughs> <laughs> that was very funny. Yes, two. Autism is a choice. Finally, you're the autism spectrum. <laughs> yes, I'm familiar, fall, right? Mm -hmm. Where do you think I fall in the spectrum, huh? Pretty high like, based on that complexion that? for some reason. That's me. No, <laughs> I'm all the way over here. I'm not on the spectrum because I choose to not be in there. I choose to not be autistic. You probably think I'm here. Or over here, or here. I'm in my open you, Ren. <laughs> uh, um, so no, you get the you get the point. You get the point. Let's get back to talking about which foods have the weirdest textures. We were on old bread, right? With that crunchy and slimy, from only when it's wet, right? How did they get like that Sigma TED Talk music in the background that makes it hit totally different? It's so good. Down, 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 down. Autism is a choice. Oh, uh, it makes me sad because I have a really big issue with food textures. Everyone does. It's not a special <laughs> autism thing. Everyone does. The autists get together and they're like, I am different. I don't like moldy things. It feels icky. And everyone's like, yeah, neither do I? And they're like, no, no, because I come from a rich family. I need to find something that makes me different. And autism is my thing because you can't really define it so much. I don't give a fuck. Well, the real autists will agree with me. I count things and that is my autistic trait and if you can't deal with that you can't deal with me uh yeah i count things all the time it's how i know how much money i have <laughs> no i count them all i can't help it me i don't like the texture of poo it's wet it's stinky i don't like that and that is my autistic trait <laughs> yeah well uh no one likes it because it's poo and your biological fucking evolution the monkey brain told you not to like it <laughs> It's true. I trust you, babe. You are off, queen. And I am actually on the spectrum. Yeah. I'm actually going to get a, a spectrum test. You need to. For a video. It's so funny. Okay, that's a little autisphobic. I, I've done a spectrum test on Josh. He did not score well. It's because I... Has anyone seen me bird? She went out for a loaf of bread and 20 bifters and I have not seen her since. <laughs> Is that real? I know audio AI video is getting strange. I know something British happened. What's going on with Megan and Harry? How many bifters did she go out for? 20. I love women. I respect women. <laughs> Classic reason. Do you want a tampon, man. baby? <laughs> I don't mind. I like tampons. They're fun to play with. Look at these. <laughs> I so feel so sorry for you guys. They used to have bleach in because, look, 100% free from fragrance and bleach. They're trying to bleach your, your fucking bath canal. I would never bleach your bath canal. Yeah, I would only live inside there. I would soak in there. Do you know what soaking is? Google it. <laughs> Mm. How long is this? Okay. <laughs> this is making me uncomfortable. Is this what women want? This is what women want? Can I just tell you that you don't need to be orchist- <laughs> You don't- Okay, it's done now. She's- she's set off. <laughs> You don't need to be autistic to know that I don't like the texture of that man there. He's cold and he's wet. I can guarantee you that. Look at him, he's clammy. He's so skinny. Me casually eating popcorn out of the bowl. Me and all my siblings have projectile vomited in throughout our childhood. Right? Tell me you haven't been there. Tell me. You can't. You can't. I never really puked. Well, we never had a puke bowl growing yeah, up. Really? We had we a never puke really bowl. Had it was one of the big ones. And we put all our popcorn in there because it <laughs> could fit all the popcorn and also my vomit. <laughs> Sorry, you're not my type. <laughs> Damn, the glow up. Man, Sparky Boy 85. Man, he's really back. They put him on lay-by. He's fresh out the oven. Got the puffer jacket. Oh, he turned the comments off. Oh, that's actually so sad. Mm. Anyway, he's killing it out there, Sparky Boy. Oh, that Boy. makes me really sad. 
Don't drink and drive, guys. Drinking motorcycles is much cooler and the ladies love it. Bam. Goofy's silly grandpa. Someone <laughs> changed the Wi-Fi password. Grandpa just posted another TikTok about drink driving. When my vape dies, so I smoke a cig. Me. <laughs> what the f*** is that fit? When my vibrator dies, so I use my hands. Me. Pilgrim, Pilgrim Kim. Going through the struggles. Is this what they're going to show you? Like Lily Pad Jr. or whatever the f*** that weird billionaire kids are going to be named? When I was dishes by hand instead of using the dishwasher. What the f*** does that mean, Pilgrim no, Kim? You don't read it in too much. When I run out of mood stabilizer so I take a walk instead of blowing up an orphanage. True. Mm. Me doing the two minutes after my phone dies and I have to wait for it to charge. True, Pilgrim Kim. I could see why Kanye left. <laughs> Babe. <laughs> oh my God, that was the most offended I've ever seen you look. She didn't leave her. Kim left him. Oh my God. Wow. This is a very different kind of uh, TikTok. If you need the law, you mad. I Okay. Whoever's sneaking into my room and putting poop in my butt, please stop. I will not stop, because I am the poop bandit, the master of poop, the dealer of duke. I am the, the one and only, the shifter of shit. Uh. Every day I'm waiting for like <laughs> a phone call at 3 a.m. of Juicy doing exactly this. <laughs> this is so annoying because I told you that this guy exists. You didn't fucking believe me. You thought I was trying to scare you. And why do you have to keep going to the toilet in the middle of like watching movies, Josh? It's exactly how I described him. He even talks weird. <laughs> this is everyone else being born versus me being born. Oh, everyone else. Wow, wow, etc. Oh, I'm covered in juice. Someone get all this juice off me. It's disgusting. Versus me being born. Anyone got a lighter? Anyone got... Nice t midwife. Can I have a sip? <laughs> Sorry, I've just drank your boobs off. Nothing but nipples remain. I was nine months sober as well. Anyway, I'm off to the pub. What the hell, Mum? This is disgusting. Get off me. What is this? I'm going to chew through it. <laughs> <laughs> See you guys later. Dad, nice to meet you. So, see you later. <laughs> that was pretty much how I was born as well. You know, I love that. That was pretty good. Pretty funny. Okay. Oh, so good. And you sleeping with the enemy. <laughs> you sleeping, let me see. They been with five people behind your back. Wow. Buck wow. Buck wow. I'm getting reverse. Probably some reverse cow. That's the two. The yellow of two tapped it twice. This is what I'm saying. You have to understand. I'm not on here doing this for me. I'm doing this for you. You are slowly sliding up the scale, Margo. <laughs> You're in danger. You're heading towards the danger zone right no, now. No, I've worked so hard. You're right, no, to be you are going, you're going back. No. <laughs> All right, let's Did continue. Did you like that one? Yes. Too? Physically, I'm vaping in the handicap stall, but mentally, I'm way down yonder on the Chattahoochee. One million likes? How? Tell me why that's funny. Tell me. So real. So real. So real? How many times have you been down on the Chattahoochee? How many times mentally? Just, just count them on Eight. one hand. Eight. Eight on one hand. What the fuck is the Chattahoochee? <laughs> me when the person I've been violently slandering walks into the room. <laughs> Okay, this has happened to me. That is accurate. Too many times when I'm drunk. Your New Year's party, mm. I'm like going off on Alana, just drunk. And this person. Wait, what person was it? Are you going to believe it? <laughs> Here, do the pose and we'll play the music. <laughs> hey, Margo. That's how it goes. It's a bitsy spider finding Asia. out people think she's skinny. And the award for best insect in a leading role goes to the itsy bitsy spider. <laughs> it's itsy <a> bitsy. bitsy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sweaty. <laughs> I love it when you laugh like that. Actually, you kind of laugh like Squidward. <laughs> you laugh like Squidward. I like it. I think it's adorable when you laugh like that. But you literally go like... <laughs> but how accurate? You ever how accurate? Have you ever called me skinny? Oh my God. I'll lose my fucking mind. It's a bitsy. <laughs> Okay, let's keep going. When you're a snowboarder in the group. They know I'm coming. 
I know they going to be there and they know I'm going to do the best job I can possibly do. Me. That was you when we were snowboarding in Japan? Yeah. True. It was so me. I'm new to snowboarding. Should we have a look at a, a, a little clip? Itsy bitsy. Itsy bitsy. Oh, f Me and Margo. Hey. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. That was actual. That was real footage. That was, that's her. No, that was you. That's actually. me. But in the blue. There she is. Look at her go. Oh my God. I'm so proud of you. Mwah. This was actually right at the bottom. So we've stopped. But it was the first time. I'm so boring. But I can link my toes. You can go heel to toe. Heel to toe. Yes, you can. You just started doing that. Mm -hmm. You look pretty cool there. You look like some kind of forward snower. You yeah. finally found the way out of Shinjuku Station in Togo, Japan. I had a panic attack in Shinjuku. You sent me these while we were in Japan for this trip, right? Oh my God, I almost died. <laughs> It's okay. It's all right. It's all right. Pretty I accurate. The place is I literally jumped out, cried on the streets, on the ground, just sat on the ground and cried. Shinjuku <laughs> Station is literally the busiest train station in the world. Yeah. And there's three million people going through there a day. And when you just get dropped in there and you're trying to find a place how to get to fucking your hotel, it can be a little scary. Oh we were just trying to get to Golden Guy. When you go on holidays, but your husband owns a business. Okay. And I'm starting to feel a little personally attacked These here. These are all personal attacks okay. from here on out. Okay, well, this dude's ridiculous. He didn't know that you could just buy these little Bluetooth things that go on your helmet and you don't even need to hold them. You can just be talking to someone else. Anyway, I think that's uh, pretty much all the TikTok. I hope you guys like this so I can show Josh the rest of my TikTok. Yeah, you guys have to like this video because so she can see more. Next time we'll do a challenge though, I think, of, of some description. Thank you very much for showing me all those lovely, wonderful TikToks. Thank you for finally watching them. Did you like them? Yes. 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 Josh and I have different senses of humor, so I just want to gauge where Wait, I want to know where I'm on the scale. Oh. On the Matrix. I'd say you're... I don't know if your dates are in just yet. I'd say you Keep going. Yeah, I'd say you're there. So I'm 10 crazy, <laughs> 8 hot. No, 9. 9 hot. I should probably get some kind of addiction. Get, we could either get you hotter or less crazy. What do you want? Mm, definitely hotter. Who would, <laughs> f would not pick that? You're so right, babe. Yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching. <laughs> Subscribe to The Boys Gaming. It's a brand new channel. We put one video on it and it hit 250,000 subscribers, so that's pretty epic. And also go to theboys.store because there's cool stuff there. And uh, subscribe to all of The Boys Network stuff. It's a network now. Sounds very fancy, doesn't it? And we're going to uh, find where our cat is. Yeah. Make sure he hasn't killed My himself. My friend got to get back to doing business stuff because he's a businessman. Businessman, businessman. Hard times, gonna make you a da 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 da